Hey, Earth Signs, what's going on? This is Spiritually Gifted here. Um, we're going to tap in and see what's going on. <laughs> wow, Earth Signs, you guys <laughs> have jumpers already. So you guys could be having somebody from your past. We have the Six of Cups and we have the Devil card, okay? Um, you guys, <laughs> this is just amazing, Earth Signs. Capricorn, Taurus, Virgo. So you're in your own element here. The devil card, Capricorn. Okay, so uh, first sign, you do have someone coming from your past. We have the Six of Cups here. Somebody from your past, your past life is coming in to apologize to you. And I do, um, should I say, I am picking up um, due to some type of toxic behavior of theirs. They could be um, highly sexually active or just love the company of multiple individuals. Not wanting to settle down is what I am picking up, okay? Yeah, they were juggling Capricorn, Capricorn towards Virgo. Um, we do have the two of pinnacles. Um, you could have caught this person on phone or sent some type of messages to another individual. Could be another fellow uh, Earth sign. Okay, Spirit. Um, you guys, if you're currently not subscribed to the channel, please do take the time to subscribe to the group. Your girl, okay? Um, please show your support by like, sharing this can actually resonate with someone on your social media platform. So feel free to share any of the messages that come out. Um, you just be amazed that it can resonate with somebody within your energy, even on your platform, your social media platforms, love. Okay. Um, I really appreciate it if you do so. I uh, thank you so much, you guys, for even um, taking the time to be here. I appreciate your kindness and your energy. Wow. You guys, you got jumpers. Yeah, did we just talk about the messages coming in, love bugs? It could be somebody that has fire in their chart, if you know this person's chart. Um, here it is. We do have the Eight of Wands. So, yeah, there are some messages coming in. Um, could be from a Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio, or Aries, Leo, or Sag. Also, it could be from a fellow Capricorn. Um, we do have the uh, Seven of Wands, and we do have the Five of Cups. So, um, this could be you that's in despair, but I'm actually picking up this other individual from your past life or someone from the past returning. Um, they want to come in and balance things out with you. I'm also feeling they could want, um, they, they have some type of window of opportunity. Some of you could have a window of opportunity taking place. Um, somebody is in despair. <clears throat> Excuse me, love. Um, they also feel like you may be possibly defensive when they try to come in and try to work things out, even just apologize with you guys. I'm also picking up that somebody who wants to be friends with you guys or build a friendship or rebuild your friendship, your friendship connection, loves. Okay. Whoa. Y'all got some jump preserve sign. Okay. Let's see what else we have, loves. Ten of wands. Sorry, loves. Ten of wands, four of wands. Five of Pentacles. So this could be somebody you kicked out or someone kicked you out. Not for a legitimate reason is what I'm picking up. So you could have been left out in a cold or you left someone out in a cold, kicked someone out of your home. Um, I do feel that there is some type of message coming towards you guys because we have a lot of fire here as well as earth. Okay. I do feel like you guys are going into a beautiful path right now. Um, you're in your element right now i'm also feeling like this could be some type of authority figure that's coming towards you it could be a father or a mother this is more of a masculine energy someone's coming towards you guys a fire sign to um to actually divulge how they truly feel about you or the situation or connection itself i'm also picking up that uh Somebody feel overly burdened in regards to a marriage ceremony or a proposal, a marriage, uh, like I don't know if you're going to propose to someone on um, earth signs, okay? You're proposing to someone or you're nervous about someone proposing to you or you're nervous if that person um, is going to ask you out on a date and propose to you. So I feel like somebody's um, in their head a lot. Um, they're overwhelmed right now in regards to emotions like... Um, the chaos and performing something i'm picking up something in regards to a marriage okay what the marriage ceremony or the wedding itself so you're overly burdened about um that and you're scared about the finances that you may not have enough for the um the ceremony um you feel like you're gonna break someone's heart love bugs no you're not everything's gonna work out fine love i do pick up the sun card we don't have that yet but i, I honestly feel that everything is going to work out in your favor so don't even worry about it 
Um, we do have the Nine of Wands, the Three of Swords here, and Nine of Cups. So yeah, you're gonna be fine, loves. Okay, I don't, I don't pick up anything that's gonna go wrong. Ace of Pentacles. So everything's gonna be fine. You know, you guys are starting a, a beautiful beginning together. Everything's gonna work out in your favor. Okay. That's what I pick up for you, Earth sign. So you could be in, yeah, see, uh, this in regards to a, a marriage. You, you guys are ascending to a, a better plateau in your relationship, especially since you guys have decided to um, settle down and get married and make this uh, a unit thing, okay? Everything's going to be fine. I do see that. Somebody could be studying on how to propose to someone or how you guys want this marriage to, uh, ceremony to be. Anything? Oh. Okay, thank you, sir. I feel I keep feeling somebody's having uh palpitations, uh random like the the impulses is like rambling really fast. Uh, a lot of things coming in your head. People constantly calling you. You need someone to help you. I, I keep feeling like you're so independent. You don't want them to know why they help you. You need to get someone to help you. Um, I do feel like you could have a severe anxiety attack if you don't be careful and get someone to assist you with um, your um, the messages. I feel like you have an overflow of messages coming in your email address, your phone, constantly getting phone calls. Get someone to help you love. I feel like you're a cousin, a relative, a female relative, or this could be... Um, a gay male relative who has feminine qualities because I keep picking up a feminine energy. Someone's trying to help you, but you're not allowing them to help you because you think people are going to mess up the ceremony. No, this person knows what you want, <laughs> knows what you don't want. So let them help you love. OK, I also feel like you're putting a lot of finances into the situation and you're scared that something's going to go wrong or the order is not going to go through. Could be signing some type of contracts also. And worried about the uh, contracts itself. I'm um, also picking up too that some of you could be feeling like you're missing out on some type of opportunity in regards to a business plan or a project with another uh, fellow uh, earth sign. Any other messages, spirit? Yeah. Let's see. Yeah, you're in hermit mode. Uh, you could be dealing with a Gemini, Gemini, Libra, or Aquarius, and air sign. You could be a person that loves to do meditation. Um, somebody's pissed too that somebody keep interrupting them while they're doing a meditation as well. What is this one underneath here? Somebody could be starting or signing some docu documentation in regards to a suite to start a meditation um, business or a recce business or some type of crystal healing business. You could be selling candles, wands. Yeah, there's some type of new passion to begin. We have the Ace of Cups here. Have the Death card, so you could be dealing with a Scorpio. Some of you could be walking away from a place of business to start your own business. Oh, okay. thank you, Spirit. Give me one moment, love bugs. Let me see what these messages are. I just hate when they fall in and mess up the other ones. Mm -hmm. Uh oh. So yeah, somebody's gonna start something via a social media platform. Um, I do feel like your meditation, your affirmations, the energy that you uh, put out into the universe is working in your favor. You have to shut down a lot of people. Um, you could have cut a lot of people out in your life in order to do this. And especially someone that's a fire sign that will come in and out your life and they just want to be intimate with you. Didn't I tell you guys also inform you just a few moments ago that I keep picking up the sun card. So here's double confirmation that I was picking this up. Um, in regards to a situation, especially the situation in regards to the love bug that's preparing for a marriage ceremony or preparing to um, propose to someone and everything is very chaotic for you. Don't worry about it. Stop stressing. Let someone help you. It, specifically, I'm picking up, um, this could be a cousin. I'm picking up strongly a cousin or someone that's a friend of the family. Yeah, my heart is racing like fast, you guys. Like, you get someone to help you love. Because everything's, <laughs> everything's going to work out much smoothly when your cousin come and help you. This is a male individual, um, but their pronouns could be she, okay? Or her and hers. Or her, I'm sorry. Okay, so yeah, there's going to be celebration. 
yeah, you're going to have a great deal of celebration. Some of you could be doing dealing with a Pisces. Some of you are going to be finding out in regards to another individual who could be an Aries, an Emperor. Um, I just feel like somebody's going to come in and help you, love. Please accept the help because you give yourself an, a severe anxiety attack. And I'm picking up somebody could possibly have an aneurysm as well, love. They keep letting me see the Ten of Wands, and I keep feeling like something's going to happen while you're sleeping if you don't learn to rest and allow people to help you, love, okay? Yeah, you got to balance yourself. We have the Justice card here. Um, I'm also picking up that somebody's um, stressing about a license, a marriage license as well. Like something with the paperwork. Something with the paperwork. Yeah, keep picking that up. Yeah, there's going to be some type of chaos, not in regards to the marriage situation. Um, that's not for you, love. This is in regards to something else. Let's see what this is about. This is in regards to some type of finances. I heard a lease as well. Paperwork in regards to a car. I don't know if somebody's trying to purchase a car from a Pisces or an Aries. And someone's um, not wanting to give the title over. Something about a title. You guys are coming, like, I, I, you need to be careful because I feel like it's going to be some type of conflict in regards to a car or a title to a car. Um, somebody could have did a research and did a car fax on, or did that car fax search on the car and found out that it was a flooded car or the engine was flooded and somebody's trying to sell you a lemon. They weren't honest and truthful about this car. Thank you, Spirit. Yeah, and you were going to use this car to travel somewhere, like you were going to pick up and move, but there's going to be some type of chaos. Could be with a fire sign or Gemini Libra Aquarius. An air and a fire sign is going to be in some type of comfort. And it could be a Cancerian, okay, or has somebody has cancer in their charts. But you save up this money to get this vehicle, and now this person you feel is a, a shyster because they're not doing what they're supposed to do, or they lied about the, uh, the condition of the car itself. Yeah, you did your research and you found out that this person was lying. So be wary of uh, if you guys are purchasing a car from a family or a neighbor. Um, I feel like there's, they didn't tell, oh, sorry, Lois. Hold on one second, please. I feel like this person did not give you all the information in regards to the car. So if I were you, um, do <clears throat> your research, um, do like a uh, Carfax information in regards to the vehicle itself. Yeah, because you, this person could be fighting you about the title situation or you're um, reframing from signing or taking over the title just yet. Because you feel like there's something going on with the car. Any other messages for my earth sign spirit? Any other messages or signs for the earth sign please? Mm, yeah, y'all got something coming through and I I think that's the death card again. Some of you could be walking away from altercations. Yeah, y'all got some jumpers there. Y'all got some jumpers. Last shuffle here. Okay. Yeah. Yeah, somebody could be walking away from social media altogether too. So you do have the death card and the world card, so I feel like somebody's taking a break from social media. Whew. Yeah, this is double confirmation in regards to the Ten of Wands. You guys be careful, please, especially the person that's um, trying to do a surprise um, proposal or a surprise marriage or something to that nature. Yeah, somebody's... Ooh, I feel like somebody's going to get uh, left at the altar. Whoa, okay. Yeah, then, wow, something's about to blow up at an altar or a ceremony. Someone's about to get left at the ceremony. Finding out somebody could have possibly cheated. Whoa. Yeah. Okay, yeah, somebody's going to come and tell the groomsmen that their bride cheated on them. Somebody got caught in a car having sex or performing oral sex on someone is what I'm picking up too. Somebody trying to have their cake and eat it too. 
somebody traveled to see someone before they uh, decided to uh, take a leap of faith in marriage. I don't know why people do shit like that unless your mate knows about it. Here the seven of wands again. Somebody's doing something really sneaky, some root work. Because we got the magician here too. Could be an uh, emperor. Wow. These are double confirmations, love. Double. Somebody doing some swaps. Wife swapping. What is that name? What is it called when you swap um, partners? It's something that I can't think of it, loves. And that's weird because we picked this up in a previous message. I believe it was last week. Yeah, somebody's coming to tell somebody something. It's going to be a major tower moment at a wedding. Um, somebody's going to leave somebody at the altar because they found out that their wife actually had an affair. Yep, somebody moving towards a groomsman and telling them that their wife had an affair. They they think it's only right that the groomsman know the truth. Mm, mm, yeah. And I'm feeling either the groomsman or the, the bride is a Capricorn. I'm sorry, did I say Capricorn? That's for somebody. Somebody's a Capricorn. But I'm picking up that somebody is a... Um, uh, um, Scorpio, I'm sorry, love. <laughs> I don't know what I was thinking. Wow. Oh, wow. Wait a minute. Somebody got this. Somebody's going to be recording this. There's going to be people using, you know how the family and friends be recording stuff um, so they can upload it on social media platform where well, somebody's going to actually do this live, unfortunately, and everything that take, that's going to take place with the person leaving someone at the altar is going to be uploaded live on social media platform. And I'm picking up a Facebook account and somebody's going to have it on IG. Oh, Lord. I'm sorry to hear that, love. I'm so sorry. But yeah, somebody cheated. And somebody's about to be so Any other messages for the earth sign spirit? Any other messages for the earth signs, please? If you guys need a reading uh, for your personal situation, if anything here resonates, please uh, give your girl a thumbs up so you're supported for me, please. Uh, and share on your social media platforms. Don't forget to hit that notification bell. If you're currently not a subscriber, please take the time to do so. I really appreciate the support. And thank you guys so much for visiting my channel. Wow. So be careful, love. Someone is trying to ruin you guys' reputation. Um, I keep picking up that somebody's going to be telling the, uh, some, another person that you're more of a runner. You're not the type that like to, uh, what do you call it, uh, commit. Sorry about that noise. I guess her grandkids are there. Okay, so you have any more? Yeah, you got, loves, be careful because this is somebody who loves to manipulate. They're a mind manipulator. Any other messages for the collective spirit? Please and thank you. Any other messages for the collective spirit? Thank you. Yeah. Wow. Everybody got stalkers. Okay, you guys, if you have fire in your chart, you may want to look at the fire um, messages as well because they have stalker too, uh, stalker as well. You have fire in your chart or you're cross watching. Um, check out the fire messages as well. It was the one I uploaded. So, yeah, somebody feeling like they're a competition with another lover. And this person trying to mess up that person's reputation, doing fake accounts, and manipulating the situation. I feel like also somebody's using fake accounts to actually um, break up a situation or break someone up so they won't get married. Yeah, somebody got secrets. They got secrets. Give grandma this, card, this message right here, Papa. Sorry, y'all, my grandchild was here today. Your granny that. Thank you, love. Thank you. Thank you. Yeah, someone's going through a mental breakdown due to um being left at the altar as well. Do you have any more messages for the collective, please? My collective first signs. Spare any more messages or warnings for the collective first signs. Thank you. Yeah, somebody's throwing shade, but somebody's going to try and rec recant what they said. And you yourself is going to be angry. Um, that you just have envious individuals that's feeling like you're a competition. They see that you stand focused, 
but you knew that this person had bad intentions and you know that this person is mentally unstable okay uh earth signs this is all that i have for you guys please like share and subscribe to the channel and don't forget to hit your uh, girl up with a reading if you need me i especially give this 777 at gmail.com love and light love